Come on, core workouts. Do me some good here. Uh, yeah. Gotta work those obliques. Okay, so today we got a pretty simple job. Um, customer wants me to cut this back to the fence line. And they said the neighbor is a jerk, so we're going to find out if they try to cause problems. But Idaho doesn't have any laws regarding trees and fence lines. Good practices, if it's hanging over your property line, then you can cut it back. So that's what I'm going to do. Limb this, these two pines up here, 20 foot. And then there's one branch they want me to take off of that maple over there. So it's pretty simple, pretty simple gig. Hopefully everything goes swimmingly. Don't want no drama today. Just trying to make a living, man. Just trying to make a living. Just try to do a little snap cut here. Or we could just do one of those real quick. That's why you gotta like having a nice big hook on your pole saw. Makes life a lot easier here. And then the rest of these, I pretty much can get in there with the pole printer. The old prune grip here. see anything. Ugh. Yeah, Fisher Price. Well, that's that. Now we're gonna swap this out for a pole saw. We only got one branch to take off over there. I don't think I need the ladder. It's just a quickie. Let's see if we can't just peel this down real quick. out of here all clean try I can go like this I think that's pretty. I always end up getting my rope through one of my handles and then it makes it to where I can't do rope stuff, man. It's like, man, am I on the spectrum, bro? Starting to wonder. This is what I'm gonna do for now. And I'll just pull that up when I get up there. Cause I got so much to do, so much to see, so much going on in the back streets. All those pull-ups I've been doing, working out for me here. Gotta stay in shape if you're in off-season, or else you get to doing trees and you're like, dying. There we go.
So my plan right now is to get everything on this inside area done to where I have somewhere to to deal with it all. Start like from here and work my way around. I think it's about time to pull my saw up. Because I'm starting to. <laughs> Nailed it. tree guy you just gotta start cutting like teenage emo girl you just gotta start cutting Ugh. Ugh. yeah good call on only bringing greeny good call <laughs> let me see shot real quick here oh yeah this is gonna go way breezier than I thought it would be yeah I don't think I'm even gonna need that at all maybe these other ones down lower might need them uh, see that's how I play it by ear take safety precautions if I don't think I need them then I don't but these green ones I might saying where's your double tie-in brother <laughs> nice and compact so it doesn't irritate the ever-living bejesus out of me you know what I'm saying for the sake of everyone trying to save my dang life I will double lanyard in, okay? Core workouts do me some good here. Uh, yeah, gotta work those obliques. You know, a lot of guys who work in this kind of industry, like, oh, I don't work out because when I go to work, I work out. I'm just like, dude, it makes a huge difference. Let me tell you what, doing some kind of endurance and strength workouts, it's like night and day.
Yeah, I think I'm switching to the leg. First off, I can't see if I'm twisted where my dang handsaw goes, which makes this way harder than it should be. That one was a bit more hefty than the others. At least I know these ones are gonna be light right here. Yeah, dude, this one feels like a feather. I am the crane. It's a little branch hook for me there.
took me out. Can't wait for the day where I get someone's like, yeah, I just want you to remove this tree and it's just like, Whoa. there's nothing below it, nothing to worry about. It's the day I look forward to right there. I guess I could go and on my way up, I could get the long ends off, limb them, cause I'm gonna have to cut it anyway. All I can say is they got a very, very good deal. Dude's a veteran, first time client, and he's 70 years old. So he got the trifecta of my discounts here. This might hit me in the leg, but I don't know. I think we're gonna do it here. Ugh, core workout. Ugh, paying off here. Ugh. I think I'm gonna leave this here as a little platform. Gotta use your limbs to your advantage here. Ugh. Man, can't wait until I can climb something other than a bullpen. But unfortunately, I live in the Northwest and that's 99.8% of all trees out here. <sighs> These two are gonna stay. So everything, my feet and below, and we should be good to go. Pinching my nuts. God damn, that sucks. I ain't gonna double tie in if I'm cutting away from my rope. <sighs> I'm 
trying to get this light enough to where something I can throw. We'll just slowly climb this over this direction. Just one little grip at a time here. Is it a good idea? Bad idea? I don't know, dude. I'm just doing stuff. I'll just cut trees. I'm gonna want to put that away. Uh, I would have just thrown that on accident. That was a springy one, hit me straight in the nose. Come on, Jesus. You little fascist. God dang, dude, the saddle keeps going straight in my sack. My boys need a breather. Wearing more of this tree than I'm cutting out. I meant to do that.
always catching on something. Lost my cool on that one. spiky little stub on it gripping wouldn't have been very fun Blam, finished. I bet you I could fit that all in my truck. Yeah, just mulch it if I have to. Well, that's that.